And so the judges, what are the judges for? They're, they're, they're scoring the guys and they're scoring the animal. So that's like the thing that a lot of people don't realize is like every one of these bulls is getting judged. So that's why the guys want their, they want these animals to be as well taken care of as athletic as they possibly can. Cause they're watching There's to see actually, how hard they kick, how difficult they are to ride, how quick they turn only, back. But, and so uh, they're marking them one to 50 now. and then they're marking these guys one to 50 on how easy they can make it look or how stylish they can be, or if they're just floating by and just barely getting by. So, you know, they're, they're, they're looking at the animal and the rider and putting the scores together. And so when, so when you go into the final event, when you go towards the end, you want to get, you're thinking, okay, I have this many points right now. Yeah. This bull is like, mm -hmm. sometimes you have to pick the best. Well, you have to really get out there on the best one. Oh you yeah. Can kind of evaluate it. Okay. I might be able to take a mid range bull right now because I'm doing, I'm up by so much right mm -hmm. now. Yep. Exactly. A lot of guys will try that strategy. And do you Doesn't think style when no. you're on the bull or so then are you thinking style? Like, I'm trying to do this with a certain flair, or are you thinking I'm just trying to stay on this animal? So most of the time you're just you're just doing your job, doing whatever that keeps you in the middle, staying on them. But then if you're riding plumb easy, you'll see guys lift their leg and it's actually spurring the bull and it's getting you extra points essentially. Uh. So it's showing you're in domination and you're controlling your ride and you're making that bull just look easy. And that's what the so you're yeah so you're competing so you're not just trying to stay on for eight seconds you're also trying to impress the judges exactly yep. you're trying yeah. to get as much flair in your ride as you can to up your score. There's a lot more Jesus to it like bro. like you think about yeah, eight I didn't seconds know that. man it's it, eight seconds goes by so fast when you think about it but when you're watching so much happen so quick. Uh, it, there's a lot going on. It's like watching Flint and when people start a fire you know it's like watching that exact yep. process right there yeah just trying to pack it all in yep. Um. And do you go when, so say when it's it's your chance to go pick the bull, will you go look at them? Will you go down and spend time looking at them for, before that Sunday ride? No, you pretty much, those top bulls, you know exactly. You've seen them hundreds of times before that. And then you get up on the cage out there and it's with him and they got a big screen of all the names. And once you say that, they'll put your name beside them, mark them off. So and on the on the on the actual on the stuff you see on television, do you see them pick the bulls, or it's just matched up once they show it up? It, on the it it depends. It depends on where we're at, and like obviously you know TV producing and, and stuff. Because a lot of times, you know, if he's got the number one pick and that heartbreak kid's in there, you know, our, our fans at home on TV they want to see it. If if that's not a potential, if there's not something big right off the gate, uh, then they might not show it on TV. But uh, in the arena. It's interesting because he has been getting up the last few weeks, and he'll look at me and go, "What do you think?" And I'm like, "I ain't no bull rider. Don't put that pressure on me." <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, I, I like I, opinions. Yeah, yeah. no, I'm, a, like, I'm an open mind guy. Yeah, you want to see whatever what, he what's thinks going I can on. win on, I'll take. Damn. So I'm I'm one of those guys. Like I want to see guys be as high as they can be every single time. Yeah. So that's that's always my advice. What's like? Uh, what do you see? College. Kind of the future of bull riding. Do you see it changing? Do you see it? Is it great as it is? It's just gonna get better. Them bulls are they're producing them and breeding them to just get better and better. So it, if they don't keep doing that with the bull riders, soon there's not gonna be a guy that rides all weekend because the bulls are just getting better. So Damn. and numbers have dropped in bull riders, I think. And the amount of actual riders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's dropped over yeah. time, and uh, we need to breed some men back into this world and make some bull riders out of them because why do you think that is <sighs> i want the truth yeah. i think because society is so scared of everything that like we're not you know taking what what is it the hot uh off the garden hose you know oh, that hot hose that hit. hot hose hit yeah, yeah people like we're not letting straight item. we're not we're keeping kids in a bubble all yeah. the time we're not letting them get life experiences we're not letting them get their arm broke on the playground uh, we're so coddling yeah. that we don't let people have experiences. And uh, it's something that you definitely have to experience. I mean, and we just don't have enough toughness in society. You know yeah. what I mean? Oh, yeah. We lose it out here. I mean, it's gone. Right. I mean, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's definitely. It's in the ocean. Yeah, it's, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's changed well, out thanks here. Thanks for watching that video right there. That was a beautiful little segment, I think. But, of course, I'm partisan to myself. But you can move on to another video right now. You can check on this video or on this video. That's two different options. And you can also subscribe to the channel. Check on a new video. Subscribe to the channel. Check, subscribe, check, 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 subscribe, subscribe.